lymphoma and breast implants. Is there an association? There was an FDA report today. Let's go to our breast chair, Dr. Caroline Glixman, for the real story. The FDA released a press statement today concerning the rare incidence of a form of lymphoma called anaplastic large cell lymphoma, or ALCL, in patients with breast implants. It's extremely important that all women who have breast implants for either breast reconstruction or augmentation fully understand the background of the press release. ALCL is not breast cancer, and there are no reported associations between breast implants and breast cancer. In addition to date, there have been only 34 reported cases in over 10 million women worldwide with breast implants. These cases have been found in both saline and silicone implants, both with textured and smooth surfaces. However, to date, no cases have been reported in any of the newer generation of implants that form stable implants known as gummy bears. Finally, the risk of a woman with breast implants developing ALCL is approximately a one in a million chance, an ex extremely rare occurrence. And by comparison, a woman's lifetime risk of developing breast cancer is about one in eight. The FDA, plastic surgeons, and the manufacturers will all continue to monitor any rare or unusual findings, and patients should not be alarmed by any media spins or political spins that occur as a result of this FDA announcement. Patients should understand that the FDA still considers breast implants to be safe and effective devices, and they will continue to be available on the market. Thanks so much, Caroline. That is a great information. I think it's comforting uh, to patients to know that the FDA has concurred that patients having no issues with their breast implants, which is the majority of patients, do not need to do anything different with this information. It's something that's going to need to be studied for many years down the road to generate enough data. But I think these are the, the learning points that we would like to leave you with. This is an exceedingly rare condition. It's not certain that this is actually lymphoma. It may be something more benign, more data will be needed. It's exceedingly rare, um, so rare in fact that you are probably 10 to 200 times more likely to be hit by lightning than to contract this condition. And finally, no epidemiological study to date has shown an association or a cause-effect relationship between breast implants and ALCL. So we'll certainly keep you up to date on the Plast Surgery Channel, and thank you again to Dr. Glixman for her, her excellent insights.